Hi, my name is Summer. I work for mobile and I'm going to be demonstrating our Control TV mobile app because it requires a Samsung 2012 Smart TV to function. So the user with their Samsung Smart TV starts the application and this is what they see and it's basically waiting for um, prompts from their mobile application. So here I have my Apple iPhone and I'm going to launch the Control TV app and I'm on the same Wi-Fi as my TV so my mobile application has found my running smart TV application and I'm going to go ahead and log in with Facebook and now I am connected with my smart TV application once I'm connected I have a few different experiences that I can choose from I'll select the WeDraw experience, which is now loading on my TV, as well as my mobile device. And once it's loaded, I have the ability to control the settings of the experience. I'm going to go ahead and start the game. But this is WeDraw. It's a Pictionary-style drawing and guessing game. And the user from their mobile device can change settings, like privacy, number of rounds per game, and they can even have control over what categories will be in their experience. So once I have everything selected, I'm going to go ahead and start the experience. Now all of my mobile devices that are running the Control TV application are in sync with each other and with the Smart TV. So we will go ahead and start the WeDraw experience. Okay, and it's this device's turn to draw. And the other two devices will have to guess what they are drawing based on what they see on the smart TV. So, I'm going to draw a motorcycle. And use one of my mobile devices to guess. are synced up with the game. And there are other features within each experience. You can see what other players are connected. You can chat with other players and you can learn a little bit about the current experience. So I'm going to go ahead and log out of this experience and I can enter that experience again or I can choose a new experience. The user is given an alert to let them know that they'll be leaving one experience and entering another. Go ahead and launch. And now my mobile device is prompting the TV to start the new experience. And all of my mobile devices and my TV are currently in sync and ready to interact with each other. This is Wii Telly. It's a social media jukebox. And you can add videos from YouTube, from your mobile device, to the TV. So you can see I chose a video from my iPad and it's now playing on my Samsung Smart TV. And I can interact with that in a lot of different ways. I just threw a virtual tomato at the screen. And let's see. You can add more videos. All the users can add videos to the queue. You can do other fun things, like I can now vote videos up and down the queue that I want to see played sooner. I can also see all the users that are currently connected with me in this experience, and I can interact with those users. So you can see I just sent the iPod a message. I can also chat. 
and it'll appear on the TV because my mobile and my TV are connected in the same experience. So I'm going to go ahead and log out of that particular experience and I'm back to the Control TV mobile application. Now the user is able to select different experiences. They're also able to log in in various ways. I logged in with Facebook earlier, but I'm going to go ahead and log in as a guest. And now I am back in the WeTelly experience. Now if the user is not connected to the internet, they will not be able to use the experience and the Control TV mobile application will let them know that they have to be connected to use the app. So once I am connected again, my mobile app will refresh and I'll be able to see what Control TV TV applications are available for me to interact with. Now because I'm on Wi-Fi I was able to see the applications available immediately, but if I'm on 3G, 4G, I will have to connect in a different way. So now, when I start the Control TV application, it will not discover a TV running the um, application, but the TV will show a code at the bottom of the screen. And when I enter that TV code into my mobile device, I will connect with my TV again. So go ahead and log in. And I have control over the Control TV TV application and all the experiences running inside of it. Thanks so much. If you have any questions, feel free to let us know.